For more information, visit our website and blog www.mathswithnasir.com and www.mathswithnasirblogspot.com. Thank you. Think or discuss page number 117 in chapter 7 coordinate geometry. The line joining points a6, nine and minus 6, minus 9 is given. In what ratio does the point P2, 3 divides AB? Let point P2, 3 divides a6, 9 and B minus 6, minus 9 in the ratio M1 is to M2. Let coordinates of point P as X is 2 and Y is 3 and A point coordinates as X1 as 6 and Y1 as 9 and x2 as minus 6 and y2 as minus 9. We already know that p divides the points a x1 y1 and b x2 y2 in the ratio m1 is to m2 then the section formula is given by p x comma y is equal to m1 x2 plus m2 x1 by m1 plus m2 comma m1 y2 plus m2 y1 by m1 plus m2. So we can write after substituting the x y and x1 y1 x2 y2 values it can be written as p of 2 comma 3 is equal to m1 into minus 6 plus m2 6 by m1 plus m2 comma m1 into minus 9 plus m2 into 9 by m1 plus m2 m1 into minus 6 is minus 6 m1 m2 into 6 is 6 m2 m1 into minus 9 is minus 9 m1 m2 into 9 is 9 m2 so now to find m1 m2 values we have to compare x coordinates or y coordinates now we compare the x coordinates then we can write it as 2 is equal to minus 6 m1 plus 6 m2 by m1 plus m2 now we transpose m1 plus m2 from denominator to lhs then we can write it as 2 into m1 plus m2 is equal to 6 m1 plus 6 m2 now using distributive law we can write it as 2 into m1 plus 2 into m2 now we transpose 2 m2 from lhs to rhs and minus 6 m1 from rhs to lhs to simplify the equation 2 m1 plus 6 m1 is written as 8 m1 and 6 m2 minus 2 m2 is written as 4 m2 now we transpose m2 from rhs to denominator of lhs and we transpose 8 from lhs to denominator of RHS. Then we can write it as m1 by m2 is equal to 4 by 8. Now we cancel 4 1s are 4 and 4 2s are 8. Then we get 1 by 2. Therefore m1 by m2 is equal to 1 by 2. Now we write in the ratio form as m1 is to m2 is equal to 1 is to 2. Therefore the point 2 comma 3 divides AB in the ratio m1 is to m2 is equal to 1 is to 2. For more information, visit our website and blog www.mathswithnasir.com and www.mathswithnasirblogspot.com. Thank you.